Dealing with dog behavioral issues is never easy, but having an aggressive dog is particularly hard. It frequently passes the point of simply being worried about coming home to a wrecked living room or having an overly yappy pooch. You're constantly worrying if your dog will attack someone, whether it's another pet or a stranger, and it can be nerve-wracking. So in this video, we're going to discuss dog aggression training. The video is going to be amazingly informative, so make sure you stick to the end. But before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. Dog aggression is a major dog problem for owners. Dog aggression stems from the dog's frustration and dominance. The dog's frustration comes from a lack of dog exercise, and the dog's dominance comes from a lack of calm, assertive leadership. Aggression in dogs, even small ones, is a serious issue, and it is not one to take lightly. Resolving the problem will not only take a lot of time, effort, and patience on your part, but it will also require professional assistance. The first thing you'll need to do when working with an aggressive dog is to make an appointment for a thorough veterinary examination. Like us, dogs can become more irritable when in pain or feeling off, and this discomfort can lead to aggressive behaviors. If a health problem is causing your dog's aggression, training is unlikely to help. This means that taking your dog in for a physical is essential, even if your dog isn't showing outward signs of pain or discomfort, as he may still be feeling crummy. After ensuring that your dog is healthy, it is time to speak with a certified Canon Behavioral Consultant. One of the most important things to remember when training your dog for aggressive behavior is to remain calm but assertive. Your dog can sense if you're angry or nervous when you're interacting with him. Many dog owners punish aggressive dogs with threatening behavior back. Rather than the dog learning to behave from this punishment, they learn that aggression is an acceptable response. Remember that some aggression is born of fear. When you beat your dog, you might establish fear, which may cause the dog to stop the undesirable behavior, but you also build the foundation for aggression to be acceptable. Sooner or later, that fear you created may come out in aggressive behavior that's beyond your control. Instead, use specific methods to teach your dog what is acceptable and what is not. Sometimes an illness or medical condition may cause aggressive behavior. If the aggression is new and your dog is displaying signs of pain or acting in an unusual way, then take him to the veterinarian for a checkup. It is possible that your dog is sick or injured and that the aggression may be due to pain and discomfort. Even if your dog is healthy, it is a good idea to take your dog for a checkup and make sure that there are no underlying causes of your dog's aggression. Your veterinarian can also help you find trainers in your area. One of the reasons for not ignoring aggression could be of vital importance to your safety. As your pack leader, your dog will have a natural defensive mechanism to keep you safe from anything it deems as a threat. If you notice any signs of aggression in your normally tame dog, it might be worth a quick investigation of your surroundings. Your dog's sense of smell and hearing are much greater than humans, so they'll be able to recognize danger much quicker. Whether it is an intruder in your home or a wild animal in the vicinity, your dog's aggression signs could actually just be a sign of warning for whatever danger exists to stay away. Living with an aggressive dog is not easy, but it's not the end of the world either. Even though it might seem scary at times, it is a behavioral problem that can be solved with proper socialization and training. Underneath that snarling and snapping, your dog might just be a scared, poorly socialized pup. When given a chance, any aggressive or nervous dog can change for the better. Depending on the severity of your dog's aggression issues, the solution can be anything from a simple change in routine to working with a professional dog trainer. Whichever ends up being the right choice for you and your dog, just remember, it's an effort well worth it. Feel like you've tried everything and you're about to give up? Here's the professional online dog trainer comes in. The online dog trainer is every dog owner's best friend. It addresses the cause of your dog's bad behavior, not just the symptoms, so you can get right to the root of the issue and solve it for good. With other training programs, they don't take into account the underlying causes of your pup's problems and their behavioral issues can reoccur down the line. But not with this method. The program is based on using communication signals, instincts, and intuition that all dogs respond to, 
and it's the simplest, most effective, and quickest way to change your dog's behavior. Yes, really. All links of the professional online dog trainer program are in the description. Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay safe and we will be back soon with another video.